Hi, I'm Becky and this is my project for STEM class. Our project is to make useful items out of recycled materials. Today I'm going to make owls to scare away birds and pigeons and crows and I'm going to make pinwheels. To make the owl you need these materials. You need a bottle, tin foil, Soda lids, two bottle caps, a sharpie marker, and an aluminum tin. A styrofoam cup. The first thing that you need to do is make the eyes. So to make the eyes, you can just cut off um, pieces of this aluminum foil and crumple it up and stick it into the soda can. Then the next thing you need to do is color the actual eyes of the owl. I'm going to use Sharpie for this. And once you've done that, you can hot glue the aluminum to the soda lid and the eye to where the straw should be. The next thing you want to do is make the ears. To make the ears, you cut the cup in half. the eyes of the owl onto the body. Next, you want to make the wings to your owl. So you get your aluminum tin, and it would be best if you draw out the wings before you cut them out so you make sure they're about the same size. and now I'm going to cut them out. And now that you have both your wings, you can hot glue them onto the owl. Next, this is optional, but if you want to make a nose, you can cut up a piece of a straw until you have two pieces that are about an inch long and hot glue them together like a triangle and hot glue them to the owl's face as its nose. And now you are done making an owl to scare away those pesky birds in your garden. So let's see how it works. That is how you make an owl out of recycled items to not only save your garden but to help the earth also. The next thing we're going to make today is a pinwheel. To make a pinwheel, you need a soda can. So the first thing we need to do is to cut this can. So we're either going to take scissors or if you have a razor to make a hole in the top of the soda can. And once you have your slit, you can take your scissors and cut all the way around. The next thing you have to do is take the soda can and the scissors and cut down um, little slits in the soda can about an inch apart. So after you finish
finish cutting all of the slits, you bend each individual slit backwards. The next thing you can do is take each of the ends of the slits and cut them into little triangles. And then I use the scissors to make a hole through the center of the can. And now I am going to stick in the snail like that. And I'm going to use, I already did this part too, a clothes hanger. And you want to cut it about here and a little bit over the fold here with wire cutters. So I did that. And what you want to do next is to take the bended part of the hanger and just um, twirl it around in circles. And you want to hot glue it on so it doesn't move. Let's go put it out of the garden. <laughs> 